The storm pummeled Western Europe with hurricane-like force. Here, the wind rips a roof off of a building in the Netherlands and peels off the side of a house. Severe weather alerts were issued in the Netherlands as gale force winds reached 140 kilometers an hour. People were urged to stay home for their own safety. Those who did venture outdoors were struggling to keep their feet on the ground. But it didn't deter this daredevil, who saw the high winds as an opportunity to go for the ultimate kite surfing experience. The storm is causing travel chaos. Hundreds of flights were grounded, and in Germany, all long-distance rail services were suspended. There is a danger that trees will fall onto the overhead wires, and there's a danger that trees will block routes. We know from past experience with extreme weather conditions that it's better to keep the trains inside stations where we can better take care of passengers than in between stations. Power outages hit tens of thousands of people in Germany, Belgium and the Netherlands, and roads were blocked by fallen trees and debris. High wind and heavy snow also hit parts of the UK. Scotland is dealing with power outages and dangerously icy roads. But the storm isn't losing strength. It's moving across the continent with Eastern Europe in its sights. Catherine Stansel, Al Jazeera.